So we have the Dell Latitude XT here. Uh, it's not only Dell's first tablet, but it is actually one of the first tablets to have capacitive touch built into its screen technology. Um, and we're going to demo th a few different um, things you can do now with capacitive touch, and we're then going to compare them to what you can do um, or couldn't do on a restrictive touch screen on this Toshiba uh, protege here. So uh, one of the things that we like about the um, touch, the capacitive touch on the uh, Dell XT is that you can simply just tap your finger on the screen and scroll through different pictures. And I'm barely putting any pressure on the screen right now, uh, which is something that you couldn't used to do in the restrictive touch. So when I do that on this screen, nothing happens. Once I put a little pressure on it, the screen also allows you to do Vista flicks. But it's much easier to do that here in the capacitive touch screen. Uh, one other thing that we think is really cool about the capacitive touch is that you can simply scroll web pages with your finger um, and you really don't have to put any pressure on it. And so when you want to stop the page, you can just tap it with your finger rather than having to really apply pressure like you had to here on uh, the Toshiba, which is a restrictive touch, but you really have to put some pressure on it to get it to go. It's not as easy. Uh, it can be done, but it's not as easy. And another thing that you can do on the capacitive touch is simply just page through your windows by clicking the bottom of the screen. Uh, it's a lot easier to maneuver through windows than, let's say, on the restrictive touch, which you really have to give it some push and some direction with your nail. Uh, here you're really able to just simply flick through the windows. Um, that's a similar thing also with the Vista arrow interface on the capacitive touch. You can simply just, uh, that was my hand movement, but flick through the windows using your finger. With one nice stroke, it's, it's very simple to get through them. And that's really not possible on the restrictive touch. Uh, you can't page through them. So all in all, yeah, we, l we like the capacitive touch on the, on the Dell XT. Um, it's you know, not quite there yet in having to use your fingers all the time. We're still reaching a lot for the stylus, um, whether it is to type things in or to sc scroll on the pages. Um, but uh, yeah, there's some neat technology built into here.